let us get into the first topic. Let us look at the first structure, which is the simple structure. In the case of a simple structure, it is just the top manager and the employees in direct relation. Generally, this happens in small sized firms where the owner of the firm has a direct contact with his employees. Here, the advantage is that the decision makings are very, very fast. If there are any changes as far as the market situation is concerned, the owner is able to adopt or adapt to that particular situation immediately. There is, there is no problem as far as the decision making is concerned. The employee's rewards and controls becomes easier because it is directly in relation with the owner of the organization. However, in these cases, when the owner is not available or when the top manager is not available, the decision making could get delayed because of which the organization could get into situations which, which is not really required or get into a situation where if that particular decision had not been taken within a particular span of time, the organization would lose heavily. So in the absence of the owner, the decision making becomes very, very difficult because it is the owner alone who can make the strategic decision as far as that particular organization in the simple structure is concerned. So it re relies more on the owner's requirement and presence for taking a particular decision as far as the simple structure is concerned. 